Men experience a gradual decline in testosterone levels as they age, starting in their mid-30s. This condition is known as age-related low testosterone. The American College of Physicians says, in a new evidence-based guideline published in Annals of Internal Medicine, physicians should prescribe testosterone for men with age-related low testosterone only to treat sexual dysfunction. Physicians are often asked about low T but are skeptical about the benefits of testosterone treatment. The evidence shows that men with age-related low testosterone may experience slight improvements in sexual and erectile function. The evidence does not support prescribing testosterone for other reasons, such as energy, physical function, or cognition. ACP says that physicians should discuss whether to initiate testosterone treatment in men with age-related low testosterone with sexual dysfunction who want to improve sexual and erectile function based on potential benefits, harms, costs, and patient preferences. Physicians should reevaluate symptoms within 12 months and periodically thereafter. They should discontinue testosterone treatment if sexual function does not improve. ACP suggests that physicians consider intramuscular rather than transdermal formulations when initiating testosterone treatment to improve sexual function. Costs are considerably lower for the intramuscular formulation, and clinical effectiveness and harms are similar. According to Medicare claims data, the annual cost per beneficiary for testosterone replacement therapy is more than $2,100 for transdermal and about $150 for the intramuscular formulation. Most men are able to inject the intramuscular formulation at home and do not require a separate clinic or office visit for administration. ACP's guideline is endorsed by the American Academy of Family Physicians. For more information, go to acponline.org.